Turkish Altai tank has since its reveal been plagued with problems regarding its adoption. Most notable one is the production of its engine and transmission. Turkey had a deal with South Korea to produce their engine under license, since Germany did not allow exports of their engine to Turkey. But South Korea was slow on developing their own engine and transmission, which would also be used on their K2 tank. This meant that the Altai project had been halted without the power pack. Now South Korea and Turkey signed a deal of procurement of the South Korean engine and transmission on the 23rd of October this year. Which means that the Altai project might not die after all. The report states that within 18 months the Altai tank could be powered by the South Korean engine. South Korea will also assist the integration and the testing of the power pack, so after all, Altai might still survive. But even if that fails, there is still hope. A couple of weeks ago, Turkey demonstrated an unusual tank. What might seem like an Altai at the first glance is actually a Leopard 2 tank with an Altai turret which is evident by the driver's sketch being on the right side of the hull. They took a Leopard 2A4 tank, which I'm pretty sure everyone knows they have, upgraded its hull armor, both front and sides, completely understandable, and they mounted Altai's turret on it. And to be honest, this is not a bad idea. Instead of waiting for new engines, why not just use not only the engines, but the entire hulls of tanks which only require armor upgrades, and nothing else and mount the turrets on those hulls. Of course, this can only be done in limited numbers, since they only have so many Leopard 2 tanks, not to mention that this is not the only upgrade for their Leopard 2s. Turkey did express the concerns that the US might oppose the procurement of the power pack from South Korea because of the already ongoing sanctions, but so far it seems nothing has happened. I guess we will find out within the next 17 months? That would be all, if you like my content you can support me on Patreon, leave a like or sub to the channel if you are new. Thanks for watching and I'll see you all in the next video. Have a nice day.